So character two is going to be the left emotion. Now, the difference between the, the, the things you can say predictably about the left hemisphere is it has linearity across time and it has me, the individual. And my emotional system then has my past pain and it wants, and, and it's kind of always looking for a reason to knee jerk react and have emotional reactivity. So, so many people are trying to fix or heal or get rid of their emotional reactivity when re this is a portion of our brain which is running constantly in the background to protect us from in the present moment when new information comes in. So we want to work with that and we want to appreciate it and we want to love on it and we want to be kind to it because it's generally not very happy because it is storing all of our pain from the past. And would you call that? Character two. I call mine Abby. We could spend a whole semester talking about character two because character two is our pain from the past. And in our society, everything's about our pain from the past and our professional self. Character three is going to be the emotional content of the right hemisphere. Well, this is right here, right now. What am I experiencing emotionally? Experiential. This is where, what's the temperature of the air? What does it feel like to have clothing on? What does that feel like on your body? When, uh, you, when you meditate, they ask you to be, become aware of your environment, right? And focus on your breath. Exactly. Because, because they want you to expand yourself, one, out of the thinking consciousness and right and wrong and good and bad structure, the box that we think in of the left thinking, 